video will help you understand the ongoing responsibilities to comply with permit conditions. I will also explain the planning investigations process and finally how to raise issues including what council can monitor and enforce. It is the responsibility of the landowner to ensure that permits and conditions are complied with. Overall, the Bayside community understands that conditions are placed on permits for a good reason and we have very high levels of compliance. However, in rare cases where blatant violations occur, council officers have the legal right to inspect and enforce compliance and in serious cases will take legal action on behalf of the community. Compliance issues may include the construction of buildings that do not comply with what was approved in the plans or permit, using a property for something illegal or other than what was approved, or any works that were conducted without a planning permit where a permit is required. The rate of development in Bayside makes it impossible to inspect every site, so it's important that the community reports any issues to us. Reporting your concerns quickly during the construction process will help us to avoid longer term non-compliance. Please report directly to Bayside City Council. If it happens to be your own development that is in breach of the planning permit conditions, the Council will first seek voluntary compliance. If this doesn't lead to a satisfactory conclusion, enforced options such as fines, enforcement from VCAT and prosecution through the Magistrate's Court may be carried out. As I mentioned earlier, Bayside has very high levels of compliance, so we thank you for your support in adhering to planning permit conditions. Together, we can ensure Bayside stays a beautiful, livable place for current and future residents to enjoy.